It's not been easy. Um, I think it's because a lot of the times um, I, I like to drown myself with work so that I don't think about things so much. But when I come home, it's very, it's very natural for me to start thinking about things. And you know, up until like now even, I still find myself like going home and like really crying my eyes out and like I still, because it's like, it, it's something that still hasn't fully hit me yet. It just feels like um, maybe I've gone away for school for a term or something like that and like, or mom's out like somewhere else, maybe in Singapore or something filming. That's why I haven't seen her for so long, but it always feels like she'll come back. And I think um, it's because, like you know, a lot of a lot of my childhood, I was um, like away from mom. Like she was, because she most of the time she spent um, in Hong Kong working, and I would be in Vancouver going to school. So you know, most of the time it feels like that. Um, but then when I come home and there aren't any phone calls, there aren't any voice messages, there aren't any text messages, it makes me really sad. Like I said, it was something that forced me to grow up and um, to take myself seriously and to reevaluate my goals and my goals in life, my values. Um, so yeah, it, I'm, I, I'm not going to say it was a terrible year. It wasn't. Um, but it was difficult. Yeah. I never planned to be an actress. Um, all I know is I love performing because I like making people laugh and you know not not just laugh but like I like making them feel awe-inspired it's it's the most amazing feeling I I just love performing and um, I never I never thought that I'd be like on TV though but you know it, it's a good experience and um, I made a lot of friends it feels like I have like a second family with the sitcom so I haven't really decided yet, but um, I think I'm going to get a few close family friends and just um, go by by mommy at the temple and, you know, bring her some flowers and like her favorite fruits and stuff. And then probably go like have a vegetarian meal afterwards for her. It's going to be very hard because, you know, um, Christmas and New Year's Eve, I was just at home moping the entire time and like crying my eyes out. And I think that it's, it's still gonna take me a lot of time to adjust to, you know, like big days like that. And mom's birthday, my own birthday, um, February 19th, you know, it, it's, they're gonna be very emotional days.